Welcome back everybody or welcome to the channel where we are here back in City Skylines. And what a city we have gotten going. Uh, we got a huge what looks like a death wave going on and we're just gonna sort of let that let that be let that happen. Uh, I'm not sure why we have that going on. We got some decent death care I thought elder care yeah. I guess we're missing some. If we zoom in on this, visitors, oh, visitors, elder care, users in the city, 218, that's it. So I thought that was supposed to sort of help with the uh, death waves, but I'm not sure why it's not. So in today's episode, though, we are going to jump over here. I've been postponing this. I did set aside this area over here for a zoo. Uh, and I kept postponing it. I did put a little bit of a zone down for it. Uh, let's see. Park, right? Yep. We're going to go ahead and capture all this area here. And let's get started. So, go under our zoo. We got just as regular zoo path and a zoo path with decorations so we're gonna go ahead and I think do the zoo path with decorations and I'd like to start off with a couple plazas right off the go and we're gonna need a cafe Souvenir shop, actually, yeah. I want this cafe a little further down. And our souvenir shop right here on the corner. And we need a restroom for sure. So I'm going to start off, I'm just going to slap all the different items down. I don't know if we're going to be able to get the water one in based off the slope. I want to, but uh, it's going to be a challenge. So, what do we got? We got our moose and reindeer enclosure. We got our birdhouse. Our antelope. Our bison. Insect, Amphibian, Reptilian House, Flamingo Enclosure, Elephant Enclosure, Giraffe Enclosure, Monkey Palace. Oh, that's a waste transfer facility. We got our Rhino Enclosure and our Lion Enclosure. And then, of course, our Sea Life. I would love to somehow incorporate this, but as you can see, just our terrain is gonna be difficult to work with here so I think what we're gonna to have to do to make this work uh, let's see brush size a little bigger oh game freezing up a bit there okay that's not doing what I need it to do I need a slope to here. There we go. That's a bit better. That's more what I was expecting. Alright. Then we just have a bit of a... Whoop. Alright. And then I'm going to just soften this terrain out. And now it looks sort of more natural. We're going to take this tree brush and we're going to get rid of these trees just to make it a little easier to see what we're doing. We're going to go ahead and move this all the way down here. There's a long way to go. <clears throat> 
might change that up. In fact, I think we are for sure going to change up. What we're going to do is we're going to take our main gate and place that here. And let's see if we can't just select all this. Shiftify it here into place. We'll get rid of that. It didn't link up. We'll just reconnect it like that. And we're going to go from here. So. One of the things we got, and I think we may change our zoo sort of this to this area now and, and allow the city to grow out here. And what this road might become something different. Continue it on this way for now. Oop. Way off in the distance. So now, so the traffic doesn't have to drive all the way down there. We're going to cut out a piece here. so they can turn around. So off to the end here, before we go to our C enclosure, I think we're going to have our... Elephant enclosure... No. Yeah, parks require, yep. We are going to put our lion one down here. Oh, look at that slope, though. That's still a steep old slope. I was hoping for not quite as heavy of a slope, but... Let's see what we can do. Let's connect this up first. go from there. We're going to say that I want you to be the height of you. No, thank you. Okay, let's select all these. Okay, that's better. <clears throat> and... did I do to my road or my path? I destroyed it. All right. Let's see if we can't connect these two up. Not sure why. Oh, look at that. There we go. So that's kind of nice. It sits in there nicely. It's back away from the road. We are going to get our forest brush. And be able to fill that stuff in. So that it would be happy. Let's reconnect you. Bring you a little closer there. Okay. And I changed my mind. Instead of coming over here, we're just going to make this path loop sort of around. So we're going to cut.
come along so far. And insect reptilian. I would love to have sort of showcased near the front here. So we're going to put this out front. You're going to come along. And voila. Be able to see it from the road. Big attraction. And hopefully get the people to come on in. We're going to sink that down so it's a little closer. And can I move this back just a little bit? All right, that looks good. I like it. The antelope enclosure. Right off the get-go, coming this way. We're going to venture into the antelope area. And our birdhouse. Ooh, that's not going to really fit there. If we bring it down just a bit more, it will. So again, traffic going by. That I don't know if that would bother them too much. Hopefully the traffic's not too much. If it was, you know, we could dampen, maybe put a wall up uh, so it wouldn't bother them so much. The rhino enclosure. too much of an incline for anything right there so we're gonna go ahead and say no to that well I didn't want to destroy that come up here they'll connect these two up Will this rhino enclosure fit in here nicely? No, it will not. What if I change the height to that? Uh, no. No, that doesn't work. Okay. We're going to move along for now. Sort of follow the coast here. We'll have a path coming up this way. And try and fit the bison enclosure right there. That fits well. I can imagine this being cut out. That seems realistic to me. We'll go ahead and connect that up. Uh, is there another road under there? Yeah, there is. We'll just move that back. Connect those up. So that's all realistic to me. Slopes, yeah, that's nothing crazy. Okay, bison enclosure. We can loop up to here if you wanted to. What do we else do we got? We got the flamingo enclosure. We're gonna th put that down just for now. Oh no, maybe not. Can I undo that? No. Get rid of that for a moment. And let's go back into which one was the flamingo? Actually, yeah, that would look really good. 
right here. Can I get it to join up? That's the question. Should be able to, uh... Now, I want you to join up in the middle. Why don't you let me join it to the middle? Well, it has to go to the corner, eh? Alright. Uh, let's see. Is there a front end sort of thing to this, or what? The moose and reindeer enclosure? And the elephant enclosure. So I'm thinking the elephant one we are going to... Put it at the end. Grab ourselves a pathway. Okay, you have to be on that side. Okay, and again, we will we'll fix this height. So it matches up. Yes, and they can move back to their enclosures. Will this let me join this up or break it? Okay, it actually sort of joined it up. No, no, it didn't. Oh my god, it did. But we are going to offset it just like that. Oh, I like that. <clears throat> and... Connect that there. We got our birdhouse, which we're going to relocate to this side now. So it's a little further away from the hustle and bustle noise. And same thing with our antelope. I don't think they would really appreciate having all the noise. I mean, they are animals. They do like their peace and quiet and not you know, the hustle and bustle of cars. Can I get you to drop? That's a decent height. And even this, look at this, this is really well offset. Or well, uh, a good height. Our elephants are a little far away, to be honest with you. I think I think I'd like to bring them may as well bring them and connect them up too, I think. Just like that. And it leaves a bit more buffer space for some forest. So we're gonna throw some forest down. More so for the animals, not I'm not too worried about the people and the noise. I want to have less disturbance for the animals. And just looking at this, I wonder if this shouldn't be a little higher. Whoop. 
There we go. Nice gentle slope. Less of a in digging there. And really this is pretty pretty low too. I think we'd realistically we'd have it something like that. Can we soften the train here? Yeah. Oh, that looks way better. Less of a cliff sort of thing. We'll do the same thing here. All on this edge. Alright, and it's a bit of a walk from here to get down to see the sea life. Alright, so we got a few issues. Mainly... Oh, just a power issue. Uh, let's see. Can we just put one of these down? Would that jump the power enough for us? Maybe another plaza. And another cafe. Yeah, that's going to appease them. I'm actually going to... Will that work? Yes, yes it will. Can I do something different with this one? So I'm not happy with the height of that. We'll move you down there, restrooms. And they're not gonna complain about They're not complaining about uh, power anymore, so we're gonna continue. Oh, excuse me. We're going to continue running our power or our, our water. And I'm not a huge. I love the look of this road, but I don't like. Oh, I forgot the giraffe enclosure and the monkey palace. Whoops. Let's see. <coughs> the giraffe enclosure. Oh gosh, excuse me. And just as we place that down, we get that notice. Um, not really happy with the way that looks. I um, wonder if we can't fit the giraffe enclosure over here. No sir, not like that. Dear heavens. Okay. So, I'm going to shift some stuff around. I like this flamingo enclosure. Is now going to go over here. So, we can put this giraffe one over here. <laughs> and everything's a complete, utter mess. So, go ahead and, I guess this is the side that people would kind of come view on, so, we'll raise that up to there.
just going to connect that up to there and this up to there. And will it let me? Oh, going too wonky. No, I don't think it will. And we got to get the monkey pal scene too. Thinking this, if I can grab it, is going to go back here, and this is going to come something like that. <clears throat> Decorated one. And I want to know why this is way down there. Let's bump that up. Birdhouse almost fits in there if I shift everything down a bit here. And then I can take this antelope one turn you like that and our whatever one this one is I forget <clears throat> actually fit right fit right in there Alright, uh, we are going to create a bit of a slinky path through the woods here. See if we can't shiftify that over there. Gives people a little bit of an option for a little bit of a nature walk. We got our fl flamingo enclosure, our giraffes, antelopes, and moose, reindeer, bird, monkey, uh, elephant. Okay, we are going to smoothify again. See, we can't just get rid of some of these slopes. Guess that's about as good as that's going to get. <clears throat> with working with the train we got, it is not going to be perfectly level. And something we need to do is. Actually. We we need some more restrooms down here, I would say. So we're going to plop one down here. And one right here, maybe. And that should be good, I figure. And then we're going to put up our zoo fence. It's going to be in slightly from the road. Hopefully we don't destroy too many trees. Oh, we're going to destroy all kinds of trees. Let's turn 
turn off snapping. So we can sort of go exactly where we want. All the way along the road here. up nicely there and then we'll start off again sort of to the end of the zoo area we'll just say this is all land owned by the zoo as well we're going to tree brush some more in oh we got a death here a wicked not <laughs> uh, <clears throat> something we are gonna add in is right across the street is where we're gonna put our parking instead of right there to uh because i don't want like the parking along this road so we're going to say that you can't park along here Well, we're going to pause the game and, oh shoot, I'm trying to remember how to get into there. It's been a little bit since I've been playing, to be honest with you. Road condition, okay. I think, yeah, this is... We're going to go a large parking lot. each side and connect these up nope that is not what I wanted let's try something like this no I wonder if it's because I got this oriented a different way. Let's put guidelines back on. <clears throat> Let's get rid of that. Let's extend that. Actually. Do it like that. And we'll straighten her out like that. Two laner. Will you let me connect it up now? Yes, you will. Okay, but it's not quite the shape I was hoping for, but. Uh, Hoping this wouldn't corner it off like that. That is not the look I am looking for. Wonder if just simply like this would work. Do. 
Ah, uh, that's the ones I want. And while we're here, do we have any? Yeah, we got uh, this metro, but it veers off this way. Can we get something to connect to there? We could probably get this one to connect there. But it would make more sense to just have one maybe off of there, eh? But then it's just going to be back and forth. I had changed this to come in this way and across to one of those T intersection ones. I think that's what we're going to do. Uh, this one here, yep. And let's see. We're going to have to blow some stuff up. <coughs> Subway, where was I again? This one here. Connect you up like that. Instead of that, you're going to just come straight across. Give me underground. This one can connect up to here. And this one, I'm going to put you to the right there. So we can continue this one down the road. And where's our routes? Stop. Can I find a path? That's a bunch of BS. Drag the stop. Drag to add a stop. Why is it not working? Uh, okay, it is going both ways now. I think. No, no it's not. Okay. Give me a second, I'm going to fix this up. Okay, it's giving me trouble for some reason. It does not want to add this. It'll let me do one way. Then not complete it. Oh, there it did, finally. Like I hit, 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 hit right mouse button instead of left. Oh, and it's not connect, connected up here. Great. Sometimes this game is so frustrating. Can I find path? BS you can't find a path. Alright, just create a new line. I don't care. I don't care. Yeah, can I cannot find the path. Why? Is it not connected up? Let's delete it. Delete it, and we'll redraw it in. And then we'll take our lines overview again. Can 
a fine path. Yep. I don't know why. We're going to leave it there. I'll f try and screw around and figure it out some other day. We are going to take our lights off of this intersection. Because we don't want them for now. Anyway. I don't think we're going to need them. And uh, let's take one last look at our beautiful zoo with the elephants frolicking and our mascots here ch cheering it on. Little majestic birds flying around. Those eagles, they look like eagles to me. Our monkey enclosure. Are there any monkeys outside? Oh my god, there are. Come down our beautifully forested and pathed area. Oh, we got the nice reindeer and moose. And the plural for moose is not meese, it's just moose. Believe it or not, antelope. Ooh, our flamingos. Looks like they could use some cleaner water. This is bugging me. I do want to allow people to sort of go around in case they didn't want to come up this incline. So we're going to allow that. Our bison. We're pretty much slaughtered off. I don't think there's many of them left. Our nice plazas here. Place is looking pretty dead, though. To be honest with you, not a lot of people coming. How many... Do we have a thing? Rico settings? No. Park area info. Okay, here we go. The Myrtle Zoolog Zoological Park. So to hit the next level, we got to get more people up. We're going to leave the ticket price at 10 Our entertainment value is through the roof. We are, oh, Animal Ethics. We're going to definitely give that. That boosts the entertainment effect. Uh, they receive extra care. Advertising campaign, advertised throughout the city. Sure. Not going to make it a main park. Fine for fair fireworks. Yep. We don't want fireworks. We don't want... We would want some night tours. Allow visitors to come check out. I think night tours would be pretty cool. Even more fun. No, we don't want any of that. And uh, we're going to just leave the recycled garbage off. I'm sure you know, they'll do their thing as per usual. So, if you did enjoy, let me know smash that like button and think about hitting that subscribe button thank you very much everybody for watching if you did enjoy i hope you did and take care till next time stay safe